Hey everyone, welcome back to Joystick News, where we dive deep into the latest and greatest in the gaming world. Today, we're stepping up to the plate with MLB The Show 24 for the PS5, a title that's been swinging for the fences in the sports genre. Let's break it down piece by piece and see if it's a home run or a strikeout. First off, it's important to note that while MLB The Show 24 may not be the most visually stunning sports game out there, it's certainly not striking out when it comes to its overall presentation. San Diego Studio has crafted an experience that's both stylish and polished, especially within the user interface. The transitions here are smoother than a perfect slide into home plate, adding a level of sophistication we've not seen in previous entries. However, it's not all sunshine and ballpark hot dogs. The character models, including stars like Shohei Otani, seem to be lagging behind with graphics that sometimes feel a bit outdated, particularly when you're spending hours staring at the grass and dirt textures that cover the field. Despite this, the effort to enhance aspects like hair physics shows that the developers are still trying to improve where they can. On the field, batting remains as thrilling as ever, with the DualSense controller bringing each hit to life in your hands. The balance between bat and ball feels just right, though the game could benefit from a wider variety of animations to keep things fresh, especially after a miss. Defensively, MLB The Show 24 steps up its game with new impact plays, aiming to capture those breathtaking moments that define baseball. While these quick-time events QTES may not satisfy those craving deeper complexity, they succeed in making each defensive play feel significant and rewarding, especially with the slick new animations during double plays. One area where MLB The Show 24 truly excels is in its expansion of narrative-based content within the storyline section. The Derek Jeter mode is a standout, weaving documentary-style elements into the gameplay that immerse you in the history and culture of baseball. Similarly, Season 2 of the Negro Leagues continues to deliver powerful stories, this time spotlighting remarkable figures like Tony Stone, though it's a shame that Season 1's content isn't included for newcomers. Moreover, the game takes a swing at inclusivity with a new road to the show storyline focusing on female athletes. While the execution might be a bit on the nose, it's a commendable step towards representing and inspiring a broader audience. Diamond Dynasty remains a highlight touted as one of the most player-friendly team building modes around. Despite the presence of microtransactions, the game generously rewards players, ensuring that spending extra is never a necessity. It's too early to call how the tweaks to season flow will play out, but the intention to keep players engaged year-round is clear. Malby The Show 24 doesn't reinvent the wheel, but it doesn't need to. With enhancements in defensive gameplay and a deepening of its narrative experiences, it continues to be a must-play for baseball fans. The addition of female storylines in Road to the Show is a particularly nice touch that sets a precedent for future titles. While the game's graphics might be starting to show their age and the core experience remains familiar, it's these new elements that keep MLB The Show 24 in the running. Overall, it earns a solid 7 out of 10. It's not without its faults, but it plays a good game, offering enough to keep both newcomers and veterans of the series engaged through the bottom of the ninth. So, what do you think? Will you be picking up MLB The Show 24 to take your own swing at the major leagues? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and if you liked this breakdown, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more deep dives into the latest games. Catch you in the next one and until then, keep gaming!